Okay, so bumps. So peep game. The smoke between Izzy government and Hamas is so thick that they won't even sit at the same table to have a conversation. So then the big homies from Qatar, the US, and Egypt help middlemen a play for a ceasefire between the two enemigos. Qatar is involved because they good in every hood. Qatar got a direct connect with Hamas, the Taliban, Russia, Iran, all them folks, right? And Qatar mood is y'all be looking at us sideways for politicking with these people, but in order to have peace, you need to have communication. So somebody got to talk to the people y'all don't like. Now, as far as the US, they always in the mix. Now, the US and Izzy is like distant besties, right? Because they got a little history in common, you feel me? Some might even say it's like trauma bonding. Now, aside from the family members of hostages who was like, um, so what y'all gonna do to bring our family member home, right? It was a lot of people around the world who was getting on Nettie Love K because they like, mm -mm, bro, you need to go ahead and call time out on the play because we don't really like how Izzy is conducting herself right now. Because aside from the civilian casualties, which was in the thousands and a lot of them was children, the people in Gaza had ran out of food to the point where the men out there was like, look, check this out. We just be fasting during the day. That way, you know, the women and children can eat and then, you know, we get in where we fit in. And then allegedly, Izzy has shut the water off over there in Gaza. And so people couldn't clean themselves properly, right? So now you are running into the issue of people passing infections and diseases and stuff like that. 